Hi, I'm Mew, and today myself and some other Brits are going to try to pronounce American town names. I've been to the States war a few times now, but only ever New York, and as far as I'm aware, I've pronounced that correctly. Us British people are very aware of like American culture because we get a lot of American media. A lot of American town names are like derived from other languages like Spanish and stuff like that. So my pronunciation of other languages is um, not great. Off the top of my head, I wouldn't say that American town names seem particularly difficult to pronounce. Um, but I'm sure this video is going to prove me wrong, so let's bring it on. This one I know because of High School Musical. I have a memory of Bugs Bunny saying it, I think, and he pronounces it like Albuquerque. Like, <laughs> I'm sorry if that's really cringe and awful. Albuquerque. Albuquerque, New Mexico. Nailed it. Boom. One on the board. Albuquerque, New Mexico. Ooh, I should try and do an American accent with some of these. Albuquerque. Ugh. <laughs> Don't put that in. Ooh, the next one I so know because of Will and Grace. And I believe that Grace is originally from. Sinek. Oh. Oh! Schneck Daddy. <laughs> Schneck Daddy. It sounds a bit saucy for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe it's because it kind of sounds like. No, I won't say that. <laughs> I'm just trying to read this thing and it's like, it's not really going too well. This doesn't sound like, <laughs> like a real place. Snake Teddy? Snake Teddy? Shack and Taddy. No, that's not right. Shanak Taddy. Schenectady. Schenectady. Shan. Shanak Taddy. Schenectady? New York. Synecticky. Synecticky. Synecticky? This is just like a proper mess. Shenectuddy. Shenectuddy. Okay, now I'm just saying the same thing over and over again. Schenectady, New York. <laughs> I'm so good at this game! Oh, I was way off. Schenectady, New York. <sighs> yeah, Schenectady. Schenectady. Sounds like sort of like maybe some sort of surgery you might have, Schenectady. Or like a, yeah, bad rash. I've got Schenectady on my foot. Schenectady, New York. <sighs> Schenectady. Schenectady, New York. Schenectady, Schenectady, Schenectady. Oh, my days. The next one is impossible to pronounce. Oh no, <laughs> I don't know. It's like a P, F at the start and L, so it's like pff, pff, Lugerville. I think that the P is the only thing about this that's confusing and it, that's the thing that you would stumble on. I believe the P is silent and I think it's pronounced Flugerville. Flugerville, Texas. Flugerville. <laughs> Flugerville. They look like a ville, don't they? Flugerville, Texas. Flugerville, boom. That's a funky name, Flugerville. I mean, I feel a bit sorry for these people who live in Flugerville, just because it sounds horrible, but maybe it's beautiful, who knows? Let me know. Uh, I'd love a trip to Pflugerville, Texas. Sometime. <laughs> there is somewhere near where I grew up that's called Cheshire and Boys, and Boys was spelled B O I S. So I think it's very similar. It could be like a French pronunciation, so maybe it's like Boise. Don't know why you're spelled B O I. Um, just trying to mix it up a bit, sound cool. But yeah. B O I S E, Boise? I think if it was Boise, it would have like another E or something. So I'm going to go with Boise, Idaho. That's Boise, Idaho. Boise, Idaho. Oh, damn it. Oh, so it was Boise. That's not fair. So the next one, I don't see how I could get it wrong. I mean, it's not, it doesn't seem that too hard. I'm just going to straight out say it. Camarillo, California. Sorry. <laughs> Camar Camarillo. I bet it's something weird like Camarillo. So I read this as Camarillo, California. So uh, I assume like maybe that is the spelling of Amarillo and then they just whack a C on the end. Camarillo. Armadillo. 
Brillo pad. I don't really know what's going on here. So for this one, I'm gonna go for Camarillo, like Amarillo, which I think means yellow in, in Spanish. Camarillo, California. Boom, knew it. Camarillo, California. Camarillo. Right. <laughs> oh no. I don't know, it sounds definitely oh. like the kind of place where you might, might ride a horse. Whilst I'm tempted to say Des Moines, because it looks French, I think it's pronounced Des Moines. It's either going to be Des Moines or Des Moines. I know you're expecting us Brits to say Des Moines, but I'm not saying that. I'm saying Des Moines, California. Des Moines, Iowa. You just don't pronounce the S. So basically the same. Des Moines, Iowa. Des Moines, no, no, no. I don't know what that was. Okay, this one's just taking the piss a little bit here because like, it doesn't really seem to make much sense to me. I might spell it first, it's G-L-E-N, fair, that seems all right. And then they just whack an E-L-G on there, which is, it's sort of giving me like a Scottish vibe. If you asked me, like, if I didn't know that it was from Maryland, I would have guessed it was made from Scotland. M Maryland? It's not pronounced Maryland. Like, we have a brand of cookies here that everyone calls Maryland. Glenelg, Maryland. That doesn't sound right, does it? Glenelg, Maryland. Maryland, I eat a lot of them cookies, so I think I've got that spot on. Um, big fan of the chocolate chip. Maryland, Mar Maryland, Maryland, Maryland? I can't even say that. I'm actually gonna change it. My answer for this one is gonna be Glenelg. Not Glenelg. I feel like the G is silent. Let's go with Glenelg G. Glenelg, Maryland. <gasps> yes! What's the point in having that G on the end if you're just not going to use it? Glen L? Where did the last G go? Glen L? Where's the G gone? Glen L? He's just straight dropped the G. Like, he didn't give a Lafayette. I don't know what else to say. That's how I think you pronounce that. I feel like I've heard of it. That's the place you want to stay. Like, you want to stay at a nice bed and breakfast in Lafayette. So this one, I think, is Lafayette. I used to be the biggest True Blood fan, so this is Lafayette. That should be right. Right? Lafayette, Louisiana. Laugh? Lafayette? It's kind of like just posh person saying it. La is such an American way to pronounce things. I don't know, it depends on the editor for this one, but you may give me some points. Love that fried chicken. Yeah, wouldn't mind a visit. Louisville? Louisville. I mean, it's basically sticking two words together. Louisville? 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 I think it's Louisville, Kentucky. I think this is pronounced Louisville. Louisville, Kentucky. Louisville, Kentucky. Mm. What? All right, close. Louisville. Louisville. The spelling doesn't, doesn't say that to me, but there we go. Louisville? So not Louisville. Louisville. Is that Louis Louisville? They just like drop in stuff, don't they? Like that Glen Elg. Louisville, Kentucky. Mm, no. Tucson, Arizona. It looks like Tucson, but it's Tucson. And I know this because in Ugly Betty, one of the characters moves from New York to Tucson for his job. And yeah, it's placed in Arizona, but like Tucson, but sounds like. Tucson, Arizona. I feel like I've heard people refer to this place as Tuscan, but then I'm like, is it Tucan? No, that doesn't make sense. Or does it? Tucson. Tucson, Arizona. Tucson, Arizona. Uh. America, I'm going to need you to try a bit harder with your difficult names because um, I got it. And this last one looks like somebody just mashed the keyboard. Like, part of me feels like this is a prank, but... Cause like, what? I don't even really think this this is real. Ziz. Ziz? Ziz. I'm so sorry. That's just the end of the alphabet. Zizix? Zizix? Zigs? Zizix. I don't think that's right, but I don't think I'm gonna get this one, so I'm just gonna guess Zizix. Zizix? 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 We just have to say Zizix. Like physics, but Zizix. I believe it's actually pronounced Seattle. Zizix, California. 
What's that? I need to know the history behind that because that's a crazy name. Zizek's California. It sounds like a mythical place, like somewhere like a Greek god would live. It doesn't... You know what? It's kind of a hot name for a place, not gonna lie. Zizek's California. Zizek's? I mean, I never would have got that. If anyone has like a spare room going in Zizek's and needs, needs a friend, hit me up. How do I think I did? I think I did amazingly, I'm not gonna lie to you. I was very close with most of them if I didn't get them right. I didn't get Camarillo. Camarillo. I think I did all right. People might say otherwise. Uh, maybe I've like absolutely butchered their hometown and they're like super over it. I think I got like over half. You would, you would agree, right? Zizix, see you there. <laughs>